Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Porter. Today, I'm going to swap out a duplex receptacle. Um, you could do it with the power on if you're careful, or you can do it with the power off, be more safe. Today, as you see, the power is on. And I'm going to show you that you can do it either or. And it's just a matter of not letting the positive wire touch ground or the negative. And most likely, if you don't let that wire touch, you won't have a problem. Worst case scenario, if it does touch, a little spark may trip the breaker. No big deal. You can reset it. But sometimes you got to practice not not doing it. So, um, as you can see, I got a regular duplex receptacle. That's a 15 amp. If you guys don't know, that's a 15 amp because there's no no slot for the 20 amp slot. So that's a regular duplex 15 amp circuit. And it does have the slots where you can put the wires on the side of the screw. Or you could choose to do the shepherd hook around the screw clockwise. Now, this particular setup that they have back there, um, I don't recommend using that kind of stab or jab setup because sometimes you do get loose connections. If, you, if that was the option, then you should go around the screw. But this one here, this one is a different setup. It kind of tightens up on it rather than it being a flimsy connection. So I'm going to set this up here. Let me see if we can, um, if we can. All right, guys, sorry about that. Um, basically, yeah, I'm going to change out this outlet. And see how it works out. Say it again? Hang on. Yeah, I've been there. But we forgot. I think they forgot. Well, I seen it. I think they didn't, they didn't move the stove. We need to put one back there for what you say.
You gonna change them all? I'm gonna change the ones that are damaged. I mean, yeah. Is this one weird too? Uh, yep. Yeah. It's a few of them that's damaged. I'm just gonna change those ones. They look in good working condition. Yeah. I'm fine. Do you see that? That's damaged. Remember brass screws are for the for the hot wires. So brass is for the black wires and silver for the neutral or the return. That's basically it. So you got your ground, you got your neutrals. And it's just a matter of pushing it back into the box. But that's pretty much pretty much it. Just, just tighten these up. Some people wrap them with tape. If I have a plastic box, I use it on that with tape. If you have a metal box, it's, it's optional. You don't just have to say you have to do it, but you just do it so the wires don't short out, don't ground out on the box itself.
that's pretty much it. back in, make sure the power is working. Let's just see. The lights on. So that wasn't too bad. Now you don't have to do it with the power on. I'm just showing you that it could be done with the power on. Um that's a damaged receptacle. Hmm. Wouldn't recommend using that. Um that one's gonna get changed out as well. As you see, the, the ground is broken on there. So we're gonna change up that ground. All right, guys, catch you on the next one.